we got the opportunity to host this regional championship through a bid process, so we were very excited that um, we were chosen to host this regional. And we hosted the Pac-12 championships last year, which was a great kind of dress rehearsal for this meet. Um, you know, it's a, it's a great opportunity being able to host, you know, here on our own turf. You know, a lot of people say home field advantage. We're in the gym. We've got the home uh, floor advantage in, in, in Haas. Um, the girls are very comfortable. We're going to have our own fans. Um, the energy of, of Haas is always very exciting. Um, so it definitely gives us an advantage just, just having that, that comfort level that we don't necessarily have when we're on the road. You know, some of the other advantages are the fact that we don't have to travel. Uh, you know, we don't have to get off a, off a plane. We don't have to fly all the way over to the East Coast. Um, you know, we're in our own time zone. Um, we can have a normal week of school, which is great for the girls. Um, and then, of course, the equipment in the arena, you know, I mean, uh, we do have a practice day and, and all six teams do get to come into Haas and, and practice on the equipment, um, but we already know what it feels like to be in there. We know the timing of the bars and the floor and the vault, um, and of course, um, you know, just being on the beam under the lights uh, in our arena uh, gives us that comfortable advantage. You know, if we were to qualify on to the, uh, to the NCAA championships, which you have to be in the top two uh, coming out of each region, there are six regionals across the country, so 12 teams advance. You know, it would be huge for this program. That, that's, that's what we work so hard for each year. And um, every year we've been taking one step closer to reaching that goal of making it to the national championships. Um, you know, and it would just solidify everything that, that everybody who touches this program has been putting in. You know, honestly, for the last four years since we've been here. Uh, our student athletes certainly know the history of this program. Um, they also know that when, when they came in, you know, our seniors now that have really been with me for four years, um, they know where we were and, and they know the, the road that we had ahead of us um, and what we've been building really over the last four years. So, I mean, I think it would make it extra special for them to, to cap off their senior year uh, to make it to the national championships. Yeah, this season has been amazing. You know, again, the girls are putting in the work in the gym every single day, so it's not really a surprise. Um, we've just had to get them to, to believe in themselves and believe that they're prepared. Um, you know, we have a, a strong cast of freshmen this year. You know, the, the exciting thing about our team is that we're very young. You know, out of 16 girls that are competing, 12 of them are underclassmen. Um, you know, we have uh, eight, um, excuse me, eight sophomores and four freshmen. And um, you know, we have an amazing freshman this year in Tony Ann Williams who has just you know, smashed school records, scored perfect tens, Pac-12 freshman of the year. Um, but you know, she's not alone, this is a true team effort. And we're just very excited about not just the season that we've had, but considering how young our team is, the future of this program is incredibly bright.